Hey guys, Richard here with Downgrid Survival. Today we're going to take a look at the brand new River 2, which is this guy right here. Alright, the River 2 is replacing the original River Series by EcoFlow. Uh, the River 2 here has a 256 watt hour battery and it comes sporting a DC uh, outlet right here. And of course the familiar EcoFlow display. You got two USB-A ports and a USB-C port, as well as two AC wall outlets right here. One's grounded, one is not. On the back side, you simply have your wall uh, plug uh, right there to be able to charge it up. And you have this uh, cable right here for the Anderson port, so you can connect it to your solar panels. Now with that, be advised that the unit does come with a power cord for charging it at the wall. And it does come with a cord for being able to power it from your... Uh, 12 volt uh, DC port in your vehicle, but it does not come with a cord to plug it into said solar panels. And of course, you do have the manual right here. Now, one thing I noticed when I received this uh, box sitting at my front door, I had a big old sticker on the outside of the box that said lithium ion battery. And I was a little confused because I thought EcoFlow was going to put the LFP batteries in here, the LifePo 4 that we're all familiar with. So after I opened it, I flipped open the manual here, and I take a quick look, and right here under the FAQ page, it talks about, uh, you know, answering questions. It says, what type of battery does it have? And it says that it has lithium ion. So I was a little confused, and so then I went on and, and looked a little further, and I found these specs, uh, the specs page, and right here on the specs page, it clearly says it's LFP. I confirmed that by opening up the app on my phone, looking at the specs there, and it is in fact an LFP battery inside here, which is great. Now there's a couple things that I am a little disappointed with uh, on this unit, and I'm going to share those with you. First of all, all the original EcoFlows, uh, when they would package those up, I always received a, a, a cable to connect it to a solar panel, even though I didn't purchase a solar panel. And this one doesn't come with that, so just be aware of that. Also, the, uh, the packaging for this uh, is newer and a little different than the original. And, uh, and so with the original, you would always receive your accessories in a little cardboard box, which I recently criticized in another video. I didn't care for that. So EcoFlow, uh, hey, maybe they heard me, maybe they didn't. But uh, they got rid of the little cardboard boxes to put these things in, but now you have nothing. They're just going to be loose. I kind of wish they had provided a little... Uh, you know, it's just a small nylon pouch or something uh, to contain your accessories and your manual. That would have been nice. Another thing I, would, I think would have been really nice with this unit is because it is such a small compact unit and it's designed to power small things. I think it would have been great if they had utilized this large surface area right here and put a wireless charging pad in it. Uh, but for whatever reason, they did not. They omitted that from this unit. But aside from that, hey, it's a great little unit. I've been powering uh, several things around my home. We've been testing it out a little bit. And, uh, well, let's uh, jump to those clips. During a power outage or when you're going camping, you can easily power a 4-watt light bulb. If you need to work on the plumbing in your bathroom, you can easily power this work light. If you need to make yourself some lunch, you can open up this can of corn. It'll power your laptop while you're editing YouTube videos. Or you can even play with your cats. You can take it with you when you take your dog for a walk. A little power station for a little man. What you think, Toby? And hey, if you want to learn more about the new River 2 series, go ahead and follow the links down below for more information. Hey, that's it for this video. Please hit that like button, comment down below with any questions you have. And if you're new here, make sure you subscribe and ring the notification bell so you get notified of all future videos. And I will see you in the next one.